This is a massive total to chase. You have to stay positive, but the openers are going to have to get at it straight away. There can't be any settling in. The captain making some adjustments to the field here. Yeah. First ball, and that'll go all the way to the boundary. Just need one of the cameramen to send that one back. A little bit of width, but clinically put away. Getting nicely settled at the crease now. Would have been really happy with that last shot. Finds the fielder with that shot. Cox shakes their head. It was there to be hit, but couldn't make the most of it. Waiting. Great shot, great timing. What a lovely shot, really good timing. Out of the middle, and it raced to the boundary. A good contest here at the moment. Four off the last ball, and it'll be interesting to see how the bowler can respond. Drives and misses everything. A bit of frustration after that shot, went after it, but just couldn't lay a bat on it. Position to set there, a brilliant catch. Oh dear, it's been a poor innings under pressure, and now they've got the key batter out cheaply. Lots of pressure coming into bat. We'll have to wait, though, to face their first ball. The right-arm medium bowler is coming on to bowl in the Paddington end. Yep. Edge. Amazing delivery. A brilliant throw-in from the deep caps off what was a fabulous piece of fielding. The edge was very close to going to hands. They're fortunate to pick up their first runs. Couldn't get it through the field. Maybe they didn't pick it up. Very late on the shot. Wait on it. Yep. Well, for a brief moment, you thought there might be a bit of strife there. In the end, a good decision not to take on the field. Brilliant in the field. Well, this is a fantastic wicket. Get the runs down. Really didn't get settled. Looked to be in trouble, sadly, for most of the knock. With the fall of that wicket, the new batter comes out to the crease. They're quick to take guard and face up. Wait there. Good piece of fielding to stop some runs. McGrath is looking good. Found some rhythm, really challenging the batter now. England get through another over, only one from it. Yep.
Peterson helps himself to four first ball. Not a bad way to start your innings. It can be very disheartening seeing good deliveries smacked around. Sometimes you've just got to accept it and move on. Waiting. Short and wide. Did well to get some bat on that. Yep. Pushed onto the front foot and presented the full face of the bat. You can see how good this pitch can be for batting. You want the player coming forward, but it's a tight margin. Only a touch full and put away. There'll be runs here. That's what happens if you stray a little down the leg side. It's too easy just to glance the ball off the pads and take the easy runs. Yep. It mightn't get to the boundary, should at least get a couple. Worked it onto the leg side and got some easy runs. Wait. Straight to the fielder. End of the over, and again it's a good one for the bowling side. Not letting batters build any momentum. Trouble. Oh, gone. It's the wicket they so desperately wanted. They've removed a real threat before they could get going. And with that wicket, the new batter will mark their guard. They just need to rotate the strike early on as they get settled. Does very well to get quickly across to that one. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great last ball to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. Yep. It's getting to where this is becoming a problem. Elder! It's obvious it isn't out, but they appeal anyway. An innings that promised much and really, in the end, delivered very little. Pretty disappointing all round. And with that wicket, we'll see a change out in the... Stewart, whose first task is getting themselves settled. Wait there. Just can't seem to get the ball away. That's the third dot. The right armour is coming into the attack from the Randwick end. Yep. Really race between the wickets after it was clipped away nicely behind square. Nice shot, 
runs possible. Exquisitely done on the front foot, a gorgeous looking drive, could have been worth more. Yep. Chance to run two. A couple on offer here. Surprised they didn't go for a third, would have been a very simple run. Great shot through the gap. Perfect timing. Just perfection. A majestic shot. You just cannot hit it any better than that. Raced away to the boundary. Do they go full? Do they go short? A lot to ponder after the boundary. Wait there. Doesn't beat the infield. Right off the meat of the bat. He was just a little bit too full, and it was beautifully timed. McGrath and the Paddington end. We've seen good control and spinning from this bowler. Looking forward to seeing what they can do here. Wait. Yep. That would have been a very risky single. In the end, a good decision to stay put. The whole team goes up for that one. They feel pretty confident about this. Starting to get interesting now. That's the fifth wicket. And a very frustrated person is heading back to the pavilion. The field will come up now, you'd think. Pressure should definitely be on the new batter, who strides to the middle. They will be looking for another quick wicket. A wonderful delivery to get the edge. You've got to keep hammering away at that spot time and again. Yep. Great shot through the gap. Nice way to get off the mark. Left alone and easily through to the keeper. Wait. Collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Not a great delivery, but it's full and lucky not to be hit to the boundary. That's the end of the over, one run coming from it. England are 36 for five. Australia can now have five fielders outside the circle. Wait. Wait. into the gap, nice shot. You can't fault the bowling, sometimes your opponent is just too good, 
Wonderful front foot shot, and there was absolutely no point in chasing that. A little short on that occasion. Needs to adjust the length slightly to be just a little fuller. Too short on this pitch, and as we've seen already, it makes it very easy to score. A little late on that, no run scored. Timed it nicely. They'll look for a couple, you'd think. Keeper. A little flick of the wrist to get it round the corner for an easy run. That's the end of a very good over. Good pressure being put on the batters. That spun a long, long way, and yet somehow it missed completely everything. Yep. Good bit of timing there. Had all the time in the world to get in position to play that ball. Timed it nicely for four runs. Boundary off the last ball. What's to come off this delivery, I wonder? Can't get that outside the ring field. Waiting. Not a great delivery, got it full and lucky not to be hit to the boundary. Just threw the shot too early. Wait. Four runs added there. England are 46 to five. The right-arm fast bowler is coming into the attack on the Randwick end. Wait. Quick onto that in the infield. Great shot, at least one on offer. Got forward and was able to drive the ball. Lovely shot and good running. Yes. Head over the ball, great shot, that's racing away. That races away to the boundary. A beautiful shot off the front foot. Just textbook stuff. Don't mind getting hit for runs. What's important is to focus on getting the next ball right. right. Hit that well off the back foot, but couldn't beat the field. It was a nice looking shot, full and in the slot, just couldn't find the gap. Six runs added there. England are 52 for five.
Nicely taken. Quick to latch on to it. They will receive now the warmest of receptions from this crowd for a supreme display of batting. Difficult period as they come to the wicket. They'll take plenty of time to set themselves up before facing their first ball. Right on. No runs on that occasion. Got into position nicely just too early on the shot. Couldn't find a gap. Lovely timing. Will this one go to the fence? There was minimal follow through, just great timing to punch it through the field for four. Stokes has got the big shot away this over. Now they can focus on playing the next ball on its merits. Right on. Finds the fielder with that shot. Stokes shakes their head. It was there to be hit, but couldn't make the most of it. is everything crying wolf is not the best approach it'll just annoy the umpire beaten on the drive surely that's got to be called a wide is completely out of reach Ease through the field. There'll be runs here. There'll be one run here for them. And they're away and nicely off the mark. Yep. Just about timed that perfectly. Onto the front foot early, placed it perfectly into the gap, timed it nicely for four more. boundary off the last ball is it a sign they're trying to push the run rate right on right. couldn't get it through the field end of the, end of the over England. five off it England are 61 for six. Lee into the attack now, in the Paddington end. Chops it back onto the stumps. You can see the disappointment. The trudge back to the pavilion. A disappointing display in the end for someone with such batting skills. This one goes down as a fail. Coming to the wicket, they'll be looking to play within the V early and expand as they get settled. Edge. Confident appeal. Could it be? Let's see if they can get the ball up into the slot like before. So crucial to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under yep. pressure. They'd look for a couple here.
That shot allows them to get off the mark. Wait on. Good piece of fielding to stop some runs. Good batting, get an opportunity to score and take it. Good running, just finding the gap and that allows for rotation of the strike. Keep the pressure up on the bowlers. End of a really good over, taking a wicket and really slowing down the scoring rate. Waiting. Drives and misses everything. Really? That's just wasting everyone's time. Big appeal. through the offside easy as you like through the hands at it got it early but enough on it to get four that last ball isn't something you'd want to see a repeat of you don't want to be giving easy runs away yes edge amazing delivery nothing really wrong with the delivery got onto the front foot and found the space to get that one to the boundary End of the over, and again it's a good one for the bowling side. Not letting batters build any momentum. A new bowler is coming into the attack. Yep, edged. A little bit of confusion out in the middle, but they've got back quickly, no harm done. Both batters survive. Wait. Straight to the fielder. Maybe they didn't pick it up. Very late on the shot. Waiting. Hit that well off the back foot, but couldn't beat the field. Wait. Just can't seem to get the ball away. That's the third dot. Yeah. Struck it nicely. Could go to the boundary. Avoided the fielders, one bounce and four, fantastic shot. They shouldn't get too discouraged with that last ball. The first step as a bowler is to get the batter playing, which they've managed. If they can find the right spot, the reward will eventually come. Five runs added in the over. England, 77 for seven. Lee back on now. Yep. Nicely played. That was a boundary the moment the ball left the back. Can't time that any better. Perfection. A 
would like to see them aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. Four runs, square of the wicket. Excellent shot. You can't fault the bowling. Sometimes your opponent is just too good. Wonderful front foot shot, and there was no point chasing that. Consecutive boundaries in this over. I wonder what plans they'll come up with to slow this batting. Right on. Didn't hit that well. Very late playing that shot. Doesn't beat the infield. A well-directed short ball. Did well to keep that down. They certainly don't feel like they've got anything on that, but almost every fielder is asking the question. And out, straightforward catch by the wicketkeeper. Well, at the end of an entertaining performance with the bat, certainly a good wicket to get, the runs were really starting to flow. Broad is new to the crease. They'll be keen to feel bat on ball early on. Broad takes guard. Been in pretty good touch lately. You wouldn't want to let them get away early with some easy boundaries. Wait there. No runs on that occasion. Got into position nicely. Just too early on the shot and couldn't find the gap. Really good over. Takes a wicket, keeps it tight. Somehow they've got to find the boundaries. McGrath with the ball in hand again. Waiting. Gone. Brilliant diving catch. They made it look so easy. Another one goes off to the sheds. That's nine down. Some good bowling finding this tail out. And it certainly feels like this is close to the finish. New batter comes to the crease. Never an easy time to come in after the fall of a wicket. A change to the complexion of this match. Got to get the new batter coming forward early, encouraging them to drive and really attack the stumps. Obviously didn't like the look of that one and just ignored it. Anderson ready to face their first ball. Really needs to settle quickly and see if they can get the ball into the gaps. Right on. Waiting. Chance to run two. Decisive running might have gotten two. Uh, looking back at it, I'd say they'd have made it easily. So in the end, poor running. Yeah, yeah. They'll get at least one. Broad gets off the mark. Collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. McGrath doing really well to keep the pressure on these two. Another good over of bowling. Going with spin now. Yes. 
Well timed, but there's a fielder out there. A couple on offer here. Exquisitely done on the front foot, a gorgeous looking drive. Could have been worth more. Yes. Got forward well and was able to drive the ball. A lovely shot and good running. Huge shout. The bowler seems very confident with that one. It was full enough and shaping like it's going to hit. This is close. How close is that? Could be the wicket. Nothing picked up from the bat. This could spell trouble. Clearly impact in line, not much to argue there. We won't be seeing a change of decision, just as we suspected, and they have to go now. Not the best decision to review that. The umpire has got it spot on. That's it, they're all out. An amazing bowling display. I felt victory was only a matter of time, and so it has proved. Just a brilliant win.